Okay, we're talking about a patient named Greg, and what you're seeing is a reverse curve in the lower back. He's had three lumbar surgeries. You can see between L5 and the sacrum, he has these little donut kind of things put in there. And that was January 4th, 2011. And the next one down is the same patient. And the date on this one is January 31st, uh, 2011, and it's at a negative 4 degrees. Again, we started out at a negative 18, and then we come down to uh, March 2nd, 2011, and what you're seeing here now is a minus 1 degree curve. And the sacral base actually has increased from where we started at uh, 10 degrees to, at this time, 21 degrees. And now I'm going to switch over to the last. Uh, let's see if that shows up there. There you go. Okay, so that's Mr. Greg right now, uh, as of yesterday, 4.13.11. And what you're seeing is a uh, 21 degree curve in his lower back. And the sacral base is at 34 degrees. And you know what? He had the surgery on L5 and the sacrum. Unfortunately, they left the retrolisthesis in there of about 6.5 millimeters. And I don't expect I'm going to change that. But I like seeing the changes we've done the rest of the way. So, that's it for that.